Hi and welcome to Dr. Mix. On this video I will explain how to export tracks in Logic. Oftentimes you need to transfer an entire arrangement to a different system for various reasons like sending the session to another DAW or to a professional mixing and mastering service like Dr. Mix. This guide applies to both Logic Pro 9 and Logic 10. So let's jump right in. Go to File, Export, All Tracks as Audio Files. Please note that Logic does not export auxiliary tracks such as buses or effect sends. Only audio tracks and instrument tracks will be exported. Logic is now asking you where to put all the files. Create a folder and name it. Adding the original BPM in the title is always a great idea. Now select a format in the Save Format drop-down list. I would recommend to select WAVE as it's known to be compatible with both Mac and PCs. And now select the bit depth. Using the same bit depth as the original recording is always the best choice. Tick the Bypass Effects Plugins button. Why? This will essentially exclude the effects you have used from the bounced files, leaving the mixing engineer a chance to use his own plugins and analog gear. If an effect is part of the specific sound, such as a chorus or flanger or even a sidechain compression, you can still bounce that track separately. Now the Include Volume Pan Automation. This option will take into account the volume levels and panning that you have set for every track in your session. I usually recommend not to use this option as you want your tracks to be as neutral as possible for mixing. Set the Normalize drop-down menu to Overload Protection Only. This will ensure that when a channel is clipping, the system brings it down to a safe level. Finally, uncheck the Add Resulting Files to Audio Bin button. Then click Save and you're good to go.